The Quadranted Meteor Shower is the very first major sky event of the year, and in 2026, it arrives right at the start of January. This meteor shower is active from December 12th to January 12th, but the real excitement happens around January 3, when activity reaches its peak. During this time, small pieces of space debris enter Earth's atmosphere and burn up, creating bright streaks of light we call shooting stars. These meteors appear to come from a spot in the sky known as the Radiant, which is located in the constellation Boots. You don't need to look directly at the Radiant to see meteors, but it helps to know that the shower becomes active whenever this point is above the horizon. For observers in places like Salt Lake City, the Quadrantids are visible each night from dusk until the Radiant sets, and then again when it rises back up later in the night. The most favorable viewing time is just before dawn, when the Radiant is highest in the sky. After dawn, around 9 in the morning local time, the Radiant reaches its highest point. This means the Earth is rotating directly into the stream of incoming meteors, increasing the chances of seeing more activity shortly before sunrise. At that time, many meteors appear shorter and closer to the Radiant. Earlier in the night, fewer meteors may be visible, but those that do appear often travel longer distances across the sky, creating slow and dramatic trails. The Quadrantids are known for being one of the strongest meteor showers of the year. Under perfect conditions, they can produce a very high number of meteors per hour. However, real-world conditions are never perfect. In 2026, the peak is expected around January 3 in the afternoon for parts of North America, which means the best viewing comes before dawn on January 4. Even then, the bright moon will be close to full, which will wash out many faint meteors and make observing more challenging. Despite the moonlight, there is still hope. The Quadrantids are famous for producing bright fireballs, and these can still be visible even under bright skies. Blocking the moon with a building, tree, or hill can make a noticeable difference. Finding a dark location away from city lights will also improve your chances of spotting some of the brighter meteors cutting through the sky. Meteor showers like the Quadrantids happen when Earth passes through trails of debris left behind by comets or asteroids. These tiny particles collide with our atmosphere at incredible speeds and burn up high above the ground, usually between 70 and 100 kilometers above Earth. What we see from the ground is just a brief flash of light, but it's the result of an amazing cosmic interaction. The Quadrantids are best seen from the Northern Hemisphere because their radiance sits far north in the sky. It rises around midnight and climbs higher as morning approaches, which is why early morning hours are always the best time to watch. Observers farther south may only see a few meteors because the radiance stays low or below the horizon. 